Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 1. It is December 1st today. I can't believe it's December. I'm actually currently house-sitting in Suffolk. I've actually been here for... Stop it now. Stop it. I've actually been here for almost a week. I've only got today and tomorrow left. But I've been really ill. I've had the worst cold since getting back from Arizona. Yeah, I've just had the worst cold. I had a fever. I was freezing. I've had a really chesty cough which is much better today, but I'm still pretty bad. You are so needy. I've actually just got back from going, oh my God, you're so cute. I just got back from going to m and Food because I saw in someone's vlog, they were looking at the advent calendars in m and and there's a biscuit advent calendar. Like how amazing is that? You get a biscuit every day. Oh my God, why are you so cute? I will show you all the animals I'm looking after in a second, but let's do the advent calendar. So I actually also got my dad one as well. m and biscuit advent calendar. Ollie. Oh, good boy. This is Ollie the Collie. Ollie the Collie. And that's Monty. These are the two dogs I'm looking after. And then there's also two cats, two horses, and a mini Shetland. Right, let's do the advent. Oh my god, Ollie, you are so cute. I'm so sorry, but this isn't for you. Look. This one's so nice. Also, why has no one come up with a biscuit advent calendar before? Wow, I mean, look at that. That is a full-size biscuit. Oh, sorry, I said the B word. Sorry, guys, it's not for you. I wonder what flavor it is. Mm, Vlogmas day one. It tastes like Christmas. Right, the cats, uh around here somewhere. I'm actually house sitting in Suffolk, which is not too far from Norfolk. So this morning I'm meeting my parents for an early lunch and then I have a work day. I will probably have a nap at some point because this cold has just really exhausted me. Donny! This is Donny the Connie, as in Connemara. Come on, Donny! Oh, we should get some carrots. Hold on, we'll be back with carrots. Come on, guys. I know. I'm such a tease. Come on. I'm feeling okay at the moment because I took cold medicine and cough medicine about an hour ago. Let's get some carrots. These are not for you, Harley. Come on. Out of here. Here comes Ronan. April, the mini Shetland is over there in that field. There she is. But I would have to walk across this mud to get to her. So she'll have to have some carrots later. I'm sorry, April. Because I don't have my wellies on. And that is very muddy. Right, Ronan, come round here. Monty, Monty, Monty. Now carrot. Good boy. I know, good boy. <laughs> okay, Donny. Oh, you've been rolling in the mud. Look at you. Was that fun? Good boy. You're looking so regal. Can you hear something? Come here. Good girl. You've been a horsey girl. Oh, good boy. Please don't get me dirty. Don't eat my hair. Look at you, you are covered in mud. I'm gonna have to groom you before your parents get home. Donnie. 
That was silly. That silly boy. Okay, I am home from lunch with my parents. We went to Stonham Barnes, which is near-ish here. It was um, a little bit weird, like a little bit like a ghost town. There was no one there, but there were some shops and we had lunch and it was nice. It was a good crystal shop. So I did get some crystals because um, I have crystals with me, but they're the ones that I got in Arizona, in Sedona, when I had my aura red and I don't have any for protection. And maybe I'll show you, <laughs> but there's a weird, a vibe in this house at the other end of the house so like the kitchen i feel is fine but maybe that's just because the kitchen is like a nice room and the dogs are here and it feels very safe but at the other end of the house there's a room which feels very different it's like an energy change it's like it's weird but yeah so i just wanted some crystals for protection just to have with me so i did get some at the crystal shop today because i noticed yesterday that the i shut the door to the room that i think is creepy and the door is now open and i didn't open it and it's the kind of door where the wind couldn't open it so yeah <laughs> so we've got some clear quartz raw clear quartz polished black obsidian and then black jade i just put my slippers on I haven't even taken my coat off. So um, in this house, the dogs live in the kitchen and the rest of the house is the rest of the house. Whoa, it is so dark. So I wouldn't usually show the house. I don't even know how old this house is. I have a feeling that it was like, this seems like the old part of the house and the rest of it was built on later. But this half of the house feels weird to me. I don't, I don't even want to go in. <laughs> The fact that I shut that and the door is now open, like it feels weird. Like, yes, it's dark in there. It's just a weird feeling and I don't like it. This is also the downstairs bathroom, which also feels weird to me, but I have to use this to go to the loo. I hate going to the loo downstairs. Upstairs also doesn't feel great, but it's okay. But yeah, the kitchen feels fine, but I don't know if that's just because... I'm in here and the dogs are in here and it's warm because there's the Arga. I don't know, but also, <laughs> um, I didn't know that there was another toilet. Like I've been going to the toilet that I don't really like downstairs, but this was open yesterday. And like, the wind isn't gonna open that. Like, it's really tough, but this was just open like that the other day. And so I walked over to it and was like, oh, wow, there's a toilet down here and I had no idea. But I don't know how that opened. It's weird, huh? I'm just trying not to think about it in the time that I'm here because I'm here alone. If I was here like with Andrew, maybe we would do something, but... Okay, I'm going to get settled for the afternoon. Then I've got to do the horse's evening feed. And then I should probably clean because I'm leaving tomorrow after lunch. Who's that, Hal? It's Marmite. Look at you. How's your day, Marmite? Okay. We're going to feed the horses. Wellies are on. I have my duvet coat on. I almost didn't bring this. And I'm so glad I did because I've been so ill. So it's been nice to go like this. Ollie has to go in the stable while I have the wheelbarrow. Otherwise he'll try and chase the wheelbarrow. And he is old, but he's a collie. Otherwise he gets stiff. Come on, in the stable. 
good boy. He knows the drill, don't you? Harley is an expert horse girl now, so she helps with everything. Harl, hey. Hi, April. How are you, girly? No, I don't have anything. I'm gonna do your dinner, okay? April is in mini Shetland and she is sassy. Look at this amazing mane. I'm coming. Look at you, you are so muddy. Good boy. They're yummy. Look at those little ears. Oh, those little, little ears. Oh, Twiggy, do you want to come in? I've just been working. All the dogs are outside and Marmite is just warming up by the auger. Is that nice? Yes, it's so nice and warm, huh? I don't know if your paws should be on there. It's actually very hot. What? I spy a twiglet. Twiggy. Twiglet. Hi. What are you doing? Oh, you come in for 10 minutes and you want to leave already? Okay, that's fine. We had cuddles yesterday, didn't we? What? Twiglet is definitely the more adventurous cat and Marmite is definitely <laughs> the cuddly, lazy cat. Aren't you? Oh, little Marmite. Look at your bed soon. I'm feeling ill again now it's closer to bedtime. Biscuit advent calendar, day number two. <laughs> it's not for you, Lula Bell. So it is Vlogmas day two. I am leaving this house set today, so I need to clean and tidy, pack all my stuff up, pack the car up, and then Harley and I are driving back to Norfolk for the rest of December. Okay, so I actually got done with packing and cleaning the house really quickly. So I thought I would come into one of the towns around here because I pinned so many places to come to when I was house sitting, but then I was so ill. I didn't, I really haven't done anything. So I am Framlingham. I'm gonna look at the antique shops, bookshops. My outfit today is also extremely questionable. I, I just don't care. <laughs> Great. Hello. Hi. Good dog. Okay, I'm back at the house now. I had a nice time looking in Framlingham Bookshop. Had a nice walk around, got hot chocolate. Framlingham is actually Ed Sheeran's hometown, which is why that sweet shop had the gold coins with Ed's face on it, so. You're such a good boy. <laughs> You're a good boy. No, let April have some. Ben is away this weekend, so we've got Toffee. Ready? Ready?
Okay, the coffee bar is currently under construction. We're working on the Christmas coffee bar. I have been for a walk with my dad and the dogs at Chroma this morning. I'm just sitting on my nice clean floor. I cleaned and organized my entire room, which feels good. I'm still feeling a little bit ill and I'm tired from being ill. So I'm just going to chill for a bit. And um, then tomorrow, I think we're going to do my Christmas tree and the Christmas coffee bar. Okay, guys. <laughs> no. <laughs> coffee my brother is actually on his way back from his weekend trip so I'm taking toffee home so she's home when he gets there but I thought the girls and I could go for a little Starbucks drive-through this is the busiest I've ever seen the Starbucks drive-through and it's afternoon so I think we're just gonna do a classic toffee nut latte I'm still not in full Christmas festive spirit yet. I feel like I've got to do my tree. I've got to start listening to Christmas music in the car. I think because I just binged Wednesday on Netflix, which was incredible by the way, like everything I love. <coughs> <coughs> I've still got a cough as well. Oh my God, this is the longest this drive through's ever taken. Toffee, we're supposed to be getting you home. Hi, welcome to Starbucks, how can I help? Hi, could I get a large toffee nut latte made with soya milk please? And then can I also get a puppuccino? We're almost at the window. And there you are. Perfect, thank oh, you. There's 51 pence left. Oh, oh, to pay. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Let's get you home, Tuffle Waffle. Toffee, you've got crazy eyes. Okay, Holly and I have been back from dropping Toffee off for a while. I've had dinner. I've just been chilling because I honestly just still don't feel well. I feel very congested. I feel snotty. I'm still coughing. So I haven't really done much, but we are going to put the tree up. I don't really know where to put the tree because the place that it was last year now has my antique bureau in. Okay, so this is my antique bureau that I bought from Facebook Marketplace. I love it so much. So you can open it, which I honestly, I have just left it open. So it opens up like that. So it's a writing desk. I like the look of it open, to be honest. And I've got my wax seals, wax, stationary things, I've got some twine, note cards, cards that I see that I've just been collecting that I love. And then in the drawers underneath, I have like gift bags, tissue paper, all things that I collect to reuse. So I love this and I love having it here, but I think actually maybe I'll move it over to that wall and then the tree just go where it was last year. Oh, I'm feeling so congested. <laughs> love it because this comes out further than this. That'll have to do. I've also got a wicker tree, what do you call it? A tree hugger? I don't know. Well I've got one of these for the tree. Let's just do this and do the lights and then I'll take a break and have a hot chocolate. Ta-da! Okay I'm watching this crappy Christmas movie. Not really paying attention. I've got a hot chocolate. I am excited to decorate the tree. I've got the boxes of Christmas stuff on my bed, which I've got to go through. And there is a, a massive spider that I think might have crawled out of the Christmas tree. And I saw it on the ceiling, but now I don't know where it's gone. So I don't mind if they want to live in my room. They just can't come in my bed. So I actually got this ornament from Sainsbury's. I had already bought it and then I can't, I left it on my coffee table and Coco came in my room and chewed it up. But I cut this 
is it this one? This leg off so that it would be Harley, a little tripod, and I'd also cut the ears like Harley's. So I'm gonna do that again and then put it on the tree and it'll be Harley in Christmas lights. It's just like Harley. And then cut the ears like hers. It's Harley. I'm actually going to move Mr. Badger because I think Harley should go up here. There. I think I'm going to put Bridget next to the tree with her Santa hat on to kind of fill the space between the wardrobe and the tree because the tree is currently blocking the plug but there's a gap. So we're going to do that and then we're done. Bridget, you're going to go in here, okay? You need your hat. found the spider but I don't want to kick him out you could stay just don't come in my bed okay morning Holly, is it goats? Oh my god. Goats! Ah, uh, Petra! Has it been a hard day, Harley? <laughs> a hard day. All you've done is sleep. Okay, Harley and I are in the car. We are on our way to do dog sitting today. It's just a day visit with Archie and Doodles. Archie, Doodles. Hello, Doodles. Doodly, you've had a haircut. Get down. Doodles has just had a haircut. And I think Archie is overdue his haircut. You're looking a bit Steven Tyler-ish. No? <laughs> Good girl. I'm just working, have a meeting in half an hour. Nothing exciting happening at the moment. I know, you're like a little kangaroo. You just love to be on two legs. You're so funny, doodly. You are so funny. Um, okay, I just had a meeting, which went really well. I thought it was a video call, hence why I did my makeup. <laughs> but it wasn't a video call. But I tried out, when I was in the US, I got the Ilia serum thing. Well, I don't even remember what it's called, but it's amazing. Like it feels amazing on my skin and it's really hydrating and I love it. I also have a spot here, so ignore that. Okay, it is Vlogmas Day 7. It is a new week of Vlogmas, um, but today is going to be very boring. I am still feeling like I still have a lingering cold and I'm still coughing a bit um, and I'm working. So I don't know. We'll see. There's nothing exciting happening today. Would you like to wear your little jumper? I know it's a cold, rainy day. Get cozy. That is so cozy. Are you ready for bed? <laughs> Good morning. Kisses. Good 
good girl. Ready? 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 She's licked that. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> it's snowing. We've got some Christmas cards to do. Oh, I didn't even show the cards. <laughs> These are the Christmas cards I'm sending to Molly and Kitty. Uh, the Taylor Swift, obviously, it says, "'Tis the damn season." I just think they're adorable. So I'm gonna put them in envelopes, do my wax seal, and then I can post those tomorrow. Wow, we have to de-ice the car before we can go anywhere, Hal. It is an icy, icy morning. So the plan for today is Harley and I are gonna go for a walk at Whitlingham Park, because that's just a nice walk to do near the city. And then we are going to go to Home Bargains because I want to get wrapping paper for a craft. So we're gonna go for a nice walk. Oh, and we need to go to Pets at Home to get dog food which also means we're gonna go look at toys and jumpers and whatever Harley wants to look at. Draw some greenies. Okay, change of plans. I had to go and get petrol. It is freezing outside. So I think what we're gonna do is do pets at home, then quickly go in home bargains and then do our walk. Otherwise, I'm going to stress about going to the retail center and it being busy because it's a weekend and it's near Christmas. So we'll do that and then we can have a nice relaxing time at Whitlingham. We can get a coffee, get breakfast. Almost there and you can get out and we can go and pets at home. Holly, what's this? Oh, it's a gingerbread man house for dogs. Holly, look. That's cute. No. Holly, it's okay. Some of the pick and mix is spilled on the floor, but she doesn't think she can take it. Someone spilled pick and mix. You can have it. Holly, look. No, don't eat from the thing. You can eat off the floor. Good girl. Look at all the cool stuff. Peanut butter. Let's put this on your lick pad. <gasps> party rings? Oh my god, they're party rings, but for dogs. And they've got beer for dogs. Holly, you're a spoilt girl. Are you getting porty rings? Okay, it's more busy at all, probably because it's freezing.
Okay, we've just been in pets at home. I let Harley sniff up and down every single aisle. She's got a new winter coat. <laughs> it's still not as good as her other one. I can't remember where we got it from. Chewy, it must have been on Chewy that we ordered her this red winter coat and it was so warm and really snuggly for her. That one, like the chest bit isn't as snuggly. I feel like her chest and shoulders are very exposed. It is nice and thick and warm though. Yeah, she's got a new winter coat because she does have a coat, but it's not that thick. It is a nice coat and that is red. But we were in Chroma yesterday, the day before, and we were sat outside having coffee and toasted tea cakes and Harley was shivering. She does get very cold. She's very dramatic. She doesn't like extreme heat or extreme cold. Should we go on our walkies? Walkies and breakfast? Yeah, let's go. There's the barn where we'll get breakfast after our walk. That person is not in the water, are they? Oh, there's people sailing model boats. Holly, you do not want to go in the water. So creepy looking, I love it. Oh, puppy. Do you make a puppy friend? Come. On. <laughs> Right, we're home now. I'm going to do my Christmas craft. Harley, when I house sat in Suffolk, was obsessed with the carrots because I would feed the horses carrots and she would be obsessed with them. So I thought we'd do a carrot version. Um, I have a box. It's a little bit beaten up, but it should still work. So I'm going to cut holes in the box. I don't know whether I should say what it is or just keep it a secret and then show you. Um, Bean should be coming over later with Toffee and hopefully we can play with it. Hi Coco. I've got to cut holes in here and then wrap it. We are done. Holly, have you got your new Christmas sweater on? Are you a good girl? Come on. Let's go see if Jill can guess what it is. Lishabeth, I've got a game. Mother, can you guess what it is? <laughs> um, well... Something would be have to be poking out of that. Yeah. And no, I can't. It's like whack-a-mole, but with carrots. Like grab a carrot for the dogs. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Toph. Where are we going? Come on, we're getting a tree. Which tree? Yeah. Toph, it's okay. She never barks. Toffee, you see Father Christmas? The duck stopped the car. Jumped out, put up the hood, and down came the rain. Load. <laughs> Yeah, 
Lemon cheesecake. Okay. Mum said brownie, but I don't see... Oh, Christmas tree brownie. Right. Good girl. Petsy Roo. You gonna see Grandma tomorrow? Grandma? Are we going to see Grandma? Grandma? We're doing our morning walk around Norwich and then we're gonna go see my grandma. That's Norwich Prison, which is just such a beautiful building. That's the cathedral spire, hidden in fog. All the cobwebs are frozen. It looks like silly string. Go see grandma now. Petra. Oh, you got your Sunday cool one. <laughs> Hi. Okay, I'm in line for the Costa Drive through. 
uh, I got back from seeing my grandma and I did say I'd go and see my granny today and take her a jam donut because that's her favorite thing. But I kind of thought if I'm driving down there anyway, I might as well go <laughs> to Beckles because there is an antique chest of drawers that I like and it's very hard to find a chest of drawers that I actually like. So I'm going to drive down, get that, also look around the antique store, then go see my granny, give her the jam donut. What, um, Granny? Now I want to show you my book. Took me years to do. So I did three of them. One, oh, two. I looked at that last time. Oh, oh you looked at it. Oh, it's all right then. Don't worry. Because that'll be yours one day, will you, brother? Oh, thanks, Granny. Okay. Thanks, Granny. Oh, well, this has got nothing in it. I can't help that. Oh, I'll take this with me, shall I? Should I put no, pictures in it? Yeah, but I'll take this with me and fill it for you. Oh. Yeah. Oh, well, if you can. Yeah. If you mind. Okay, I'm home now. I've just unloaded the chest of drawers and I'll move everything over in a second. Jill and Glenn went out for a roast. I called my mother on the way back and asked if she could get me a takeaway roast. So that's what she's done. So I've got a nice roast. Hal and I are going to watch something. Where's the remote? Should we watch with our roast, huh? What would you like to watch? You had a busy day. We're going to watch the Santa Clauses. Okay, so this is the new chest of drawers, which is going to replace the bookshelf that was over there that I've just moved out. Basically, I needed a chest of drawers because I have so many <laughs> novelty t-shirts, I just don't have room. I only have a wardrobe. Okay, so I'm just gonna wipe down inside each of the drawers. And then I like to put a lush bath bomb <laughs> in uh, new pieces of furniture just to make it smell nice. So I'm gonna add a lush bath bomb to each of the drawers. Vlogmas day 12. Gonna go to the Starbucks drive through and get a puppuccino. Where's a puppuccino? We have an iced toffee nut made with soya milk. Oof, that is good. Oh, I love the nutty tastes. And then, um, oh, we've got a, a Christmas puppuccino. Is that, what's that for you? Is that what you ordered? Okay, should we take it home? And we'll share the rest with Coco and Elsie and Petra if she's home, yeah? Okay, we have come home and put on cozy clothes. I've got a jumper, I've got sweatpants on. I'm watching the Santa Clauses. So yeah, I'm just gonna have a work day now. I have quite a few things to do for work that I wanna get done. So the week leading up to Christmas, I won't really have too much to do. Oh, this morning I went to Primark with um, my mother. We just went into the city, had a nice Cafe Nero breakfast and coffee together. And then we went to Primark. I wanted to look at the Christmas homeware and I did get a couple of things for the Christmas coffee bar, which I know I still haven't got around to showing, but I will, maybe tomorrow. But I did vlog the Christmas stuff in Primark. <laughs>
actually just got home from coffee with my friend Ollie. We went to White House Farm in Norfolk. So I have actually just had coffee, but I thought we would do the Christmas coffee bar reveal and I will take a coffee to my dad. I feel like I started the Christmas coffee bar on my birthday, which is the beginning of November, but then I went away and I've just kept adding things and changing things. And I think it's at its final evolution, but we'll see. I feel like I'm just always adding it to it. Yeah, so let's make a latte for my dad. We're gonna use the Biscoff coffee beans that my brother got me from San Francisco. We'll use the antique coffee bean grinder to grind those up. Then the Alchemy Drip coffee set. Oh, and then we'll use the Velvetizer to froth some milk up. I, <laughs> I also have my North Sea, can you see that? My North Sea coffee sweater on, which I love. Okay, so the beans are in the drawer. And same as Halloween, I have the Norwich blend out from H&J because it looks pretty. This, it just doesn't look as pretty. <laughs> so I keep it in the drawer. It just, oh, these beans smell so good. Okay, then we go in this drawer, get a reusable coffee filter, put that in there, boil the gooseneck kettle, then we can also start preparing the treat plate that goes with every coffee I serve. So in this drawer, I have some dog biscuits. So each coffee I serve comes with a little shortbread and a little dog biscuit. Okay, I've just got the oat milk barista blend out. The kettle's boiled, so I'm gonna pour that in. Oh, it smells so good. Then while that's dripping down, I'm just gonna put the oat milk on in the velvetizer. And then we pick a Christmas mug. These, these mug toppers I ordered on Etsy. Yeah. You just pop it on top of the mug. And then I have this one as well. They're very cool. I'm gonna get some Halloween ones for Halloween next year. Let's use my, this is my Christmas movie mug from, I got this in Target when I was in Arizona. Now, my dad doesn't like syrups in coffee, but we do have all of the syrups here. So, there's the coffee. The milk is done and nice and frothy. We'll pick a cocoa powder duster. We've got some holly, a tree, and a reindeer. I think we'll go with reindeer. And then I have got some edible glitter that I got in Target when I was in Arizona as well. So I might just add a Rudolph nose. Oh, and these are the spoons that I got in Hobby Lobby that are adorable. So I want like a little red nose. Okay, well it's a massive red nose. <laughs> Perfect. And this will be served with the dog treat and two human biscuits.
Is this snowing real? It's so exciting.